Hey, hello, welcome, I'm Stormo, and uh, I am hopefully experimenting a little bit with my stream tonight uh, just to see what I can do in terms of overall output quality. Um, so I'm using a different preset and a couple of other things. Just try and uh, just try and clear things up and make it look a little bit nice because I was looking at it last night and I thought it looked a bit rough. But, <laughs> you know, that's how these things are. Um... So, yeah, that's just my thing. I just have this weird thing where I just try and make it as... I, I, I want to I wanna make my stream uh, as high quality as possible, and the way I want to do that, seeing as I only have a restricted amount of bandwidth, is by adjusting how much CPU time um, the encoder uses. Uh, so I've actually gone on the slow setting tonight. Um, so we're going to see how this goes. Um, it's using about 12.8. Uh, 12.13% of my CPU. Uh, if I back out here and just rotate the camera around, we should see what it can do. Yeah, 14, 15%, 18%. Okay, that's nice. That's nice. That's good numbers. And it's maintaining a constant 30 frames per second, which is actually the more important thing, of course, because if it wasn't, the stream would be super laggy and weird and not very good. So, this, these are the things I do for you, my dear audience. Um, what were we doing? We've just done a whole bunch of really cool stuff. We finished off last night, uh, trying to fight that Valkyrie, and boy did that not go well. Um, we now have that to do. Okay, so we're up over here. We've got a lot of Midgards still to unlock, don't we? No, it's not as much as you think, really, because of the way this map borders. Yeah, see, that's all unlocked. Everything down here is unlocked. Um, there's still this area. This is clearly more Midgard-related story stuff. We do have this quest to do, the Anatomy of Hope, recover Golvig's bones. Um, but if that's what I think it is, it might be quite difficult. Um, I'm So... Killing the Valkyrie is, I don't think, doable. I, I was convinced for a while last night that it was, but... The one thing that made me think maybe I wasn't quite ready uh, was just the fact that she seemed to do more damage than I felt was was right for was right for what I should have. So I feel like I need to just gear up a little bit more with her. I mean, it's it's always going to be a, a challenging fight, um, but in that particular case, oh, I just realised I've forgotten to do something. I let this story play out while I do some mad typing on the internet. Okay, so just just bear with me while I do a quick bit of typing here. Um, I forgot to spam. Twitter with my uh, thing, uh, so that that's kind of annoying. And Z, um, and uh, what other hashtags can I use? That one. There we go. I'm just typing out a whole bunch of hashtags. That's all I'm doing. Don't worry. Nothing important. There we go. There we go. There we go. There we go. Self promotion. That's what we want to do here. We want to self-promote ourselves. That's that. So I can see what everything looks like. There we go. We are self-promoting. Okay, let's 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 continue. Mm -hmm. Of course, if you're watching this on um She was called Skadi, Queen of the Hunt. Her father was Thiotsi, who could take the shape of any wild creature and taught Skadi how to hunt them all. From the ribs of pack beasts, she fashioned second feet, allowing her to glide upon the snow so no animal could evade her. She became a huntress beyond compare, even to any god. Odin himself wanted her for his bride, believing she would bear him strong sons. But she spurned his affections, and for that insult, Odin vowed revenge. It was put forth that the Aesir were plagued by an eagle who would steal the precious golden apples of Eidun, 
Not even the finest archer among the gods could bring it down. Odin knew that Skadi could not resist the temptation to prove herself superior, and so she joined the hunt. Skadi tracked the eagle as it flew where she alone could glide, and loosed an arrow from Okay. Erring bull. When she collected her quarry. Oh wait, there was a thing over there, wasn't there? But her oh no, that was just to open that gate. Yeah. The Otzi, slain by his own daughter. She was overcome with grief and shame. For there is nothing nature so reviles as a child who kills their parent. Skadi succumbed to her fate as winter's blanket fell, holding her father as the mountain held her in an embrace to last eternity. Well, that was sad. Yeah, we'll pick this up later. We did we go here? I don't remember going here. Did we go here on the way in? Did I notice this at all? I must have. Yeah, yeah, we did. Oh, that's right, because this leads to. Yeah, the most. Yeah, okay, yeah, I remember now. Okay, whew. Really concerned that I hadn't been here all of a sudden. I'm like, hang on a second, I don't remember going here. But yeah, no, we did. Oh, come on. It's dumb that you have to have that prompt on the screen before you do the drop. Like, why not just let me do the drop? We haven't been here because these guys wouldn't be here if we had. Oops, should have shielded. My shield reactions are so bad. Come on. Okay, you're done. Oh boy, having that giant world some Oh wait, 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 wait. Oh, 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 I see where we are. Um Right, wait, this shouldn't I? Should I? Kratos. I must still be oh, I'm still in combat, that's why. That should be it, yeah. Okay. Whew, okay. Um, we're just gonna go up here. Probably I'm gonna do... I'm not sure what I'm gonna do tonight actually in the game because I don't know what's up next. Um, maybe more story content? We're gonna see what's up here for now, but I don't think this is gonna lead us too much to anywhere interesting. That's the boat dock from there and this is... Ah, uh, yeah, 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 no, we, we've been here. Another name. But he can read these names now. Another Valkyrie. That's no coincidence. But who'd have etched them on Tears Braziers? Yeah, okay. So activating this must mean something then. Being able to activate that must ultimately mean something. Anyway, uh where was the story taking us now? Oh back to the main gateway. Okay. Um And yeah, are all of those realms here in camp? No, that's not, is it? That's something else. Okay, we're actually going to go over there. Because this may not be as difficult a quest as I was anticipating. I was assuming it was related to that Realm Tear Encounter. But of course it wouldn't, because Realm Tear Encounters are for a completely different thing. Um, because they're for... Those, um... Uh... Eternity Dusts or whatever they are. The, the, the things you need for, um... The things you need for, uh, what do you need them for? I can't remember what, what you need them for. Hey, oh, right, it's a, it's a thing for him to pick up, yeah. Hey, it's another treasure map. Hey, you're a giant frozen troll. You're an enemy that I can fight, but you're just completely frozen in No, you're a statue of an enemy that I can fight. Right, okay. Um, yeah, okay, let's, uh... So, that quest is literally just over there, but not... It can't be the Realm Tear, right? It's somewhere... Something else here... Is that thing... We still don't have the ability to unlock those, either. Which we, we certainly didn't get from there. Like, last time we did this, it was just the realms here, and we got murdered. But, there's obviously something else here. Um, that must be for... Oh, that was it! Magic. It must be Golvir. Could we... Could we 
just hold on to it? Maybe we'll find the rest of them. Also, we didn't go up here before. How would you know? I have known many spirits. They are all liars. It's in here. Did we go in here? No, very little. Ah, Fafnir. I always wondered what became of him. Wait, Fafnir? Wait, that's Fafnir? Fafnir's storeroom, Fafnir? The very one. But Sindri said he was a dwarf. He was. Now he's a dragon. Funny how life works, isn't it? He's chained up. Perhaps we should keep an eye out for binding shrines and free the poor bastard. Hi, lads. Oh, this is another dragon we can free up. Oh, cool, cool, cool. We can't go that way. Okay, well, I know what we're doing now. Um, I guess this is happening. Now, he's gonna have... Lightning Breath again. Is it just gonna be the same as it was? Yeah, it seems like it. Well, these guys are super vulnerable to that. Try not to hit the shields. You stun. Is that way I can do this while the dragon does that and I don't take any damage from it? Yeah. Chalk actually does work better on these guys, it seems. But you've really got to break their shield. That's how you do it. There we go. There we go. That's what we're talking about. Oh, come on. Okay, we got this. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, so this is exactly the same as it was with uh, Thingo, um, the, the first dragon we encountered. There we go. Get out of the way of that. How is that just not damaging me? <laughs> okay, so that was one of the three shrines. So where are the other two? Imagine there's going to be a bit of exploration or something. This... I, I'm not convinced, like, the other one was actually fairly complex, it was a very large area. This area doesn't seem as large or as complex, but it does have Dark Souls guy there. Whoa! Okay. Let's kill that guy first, and then get back. Dark Souls guy, oh jeez, another one. Ah, should have rolled. Should have rolled better. Oh, dodge that. Dodge that. You know what I can do though, I can start getting punchy with him. There we go. Oh, we just killed him. Okay, he's done, and this guy is about to be done, and they're all done. Oh, he exploded. Whoops. Well, that was easy. I'll open this door up too because it leads back to the entrance there, so that's cool. Hey, we completely missed this guy right here at the entrance. That was dumb. Well, that's always good. Um, this is the second of these uh, shrines, so we'll grab that. I'll just uh, look up and stuff here. That's shrine two destroyed. How did this dwarf become a dragon? I don't know for certain. I'd wager his penchant for stealing magical artifacts had something no, to do with it. not that way. Must have stolen a trinket from Come the on. wrong Vanier goddess. Ah, oh, this slow climbing. Slow climbing, slow falling, slow whatever. There we go, back there. 
Okay, so now, where is the third one? Oh, that was nasty. It's not there. Is it... Oh, there's an area over here. It's over here. Okay. It's literally just there. Um, but there is this area up here. Before we go over there, let's just see what's up here. And then we'll go smash that shrine. Hey, there's some stuff here. Neat. It's always good. Uh, new lore marker. What's this about? This, this will be about. If you're reading this, go away. You don't belong here. This is my ravine. And don't touch any of my stuff. Ah, uh, this is Fafnir. Yeah. You still here? I told you to leave. These are my treasures. You can't have them. The best stuff is in my storeroom anyway, but don't even think about going in with. Yeah, I made sure it was well guarded. Don't need any more. Certainly not any of all these stupid sons warning me about the dangers of greed. I only need to look in my newly acquired Vanier mirror to see what it... Oh. Oh. That's why he became a dragon. He got greedy. If there's one thing we all know about dragons, it's they like treasure. That's the story of Fafnir. An important lesson was learned. Okay, let's get that third shrine and then we'll go free him. And that'll be two of the three dragons freed. So I wonder where the third one is then. So I wasn't expecting the second one to be right here. This is a good little side journey. Yep. Uh oh. Okay, let's get this one out of the way before it becomes a problem. Okay. Oh, hello. Everything's a problem here right now. But we have cool fire attacks now. Also, um, I've been giving this some serious thought. I think I'm going to change the Witch Time Pendant out for uh, one of the other pendants I've got. I feel like it doesn't benefit me as much as I would like. Oh, jeez. Obviously, I can't do it while I'm in combat. There we go. Got the stun. These things are easy now. Oh. Oh, gotta watch that. Oh, just killed it. Cool. Right, that I think is all the enemies. Yeah, I think so. Let's uh Let's stab this uh thing. Come on boy, you can do it. You got this, kid. He's got this. Yeah, go terrorize some other giant lake. Or whatever it is you're going to be terrorizing. <laughs> Fair enough. Brilliant scale of the chain. Moderate perk activation. Runic when using a runic attack. Nice. Okay, cool. Flight of Fafnir. Dragon favor complete. Nice. Okay, so as I was saying, I wa I, I upgraded the hell out of that uh, thing, and I, I I don't think that was a waste. Um, but at the same time, uh, I feel like I would actually be better served by using one of these. Um, what is Shattered Gauntlet of Ages? Huh. That's Aegea's protection. I just know what either of these do, actually. That's level 6. Let's equip that. That seems strong, I suppose. Um, and it already has an enchantment socket, so let's uh, put 
an enchantment in it that isn't already being used elsewhere. Um, a lot of good ones at the moment. Yeah, we'll do that because I think parrying is something I'm going to be doing a lot more of once I, you know, get good at it. Uh, these are... Uh, well, that indicates whether that means they're upgradable or something else is going on there. But yeah, um, Dragon's Free 2 of 3, so, yeah. There'll be a moderate reward for this. Is there anything else around here we might have missed? I don't think so. I don't feel like freeing that dragon's unlocked a much larger area, but I just want to check because there is sort of a, an area here that's just water and you can't get any further in than that. It's not like the first dragon you encounter. Oh, there is a chest here. I missed that. It's not like the first dragon you encounter where it's actually a huge complex area with a whole bunch of stuff in it. This is a much smaller, much simpler area, which in a way is disappointing actually because I liked how big that other area was. This is the way we get back here. Yeah. Although I suppose you could have gone back uh, over the other side there as well. That's cool. Um, but yeah, it's huge, a huge sort of uh, area. Uh, that first one, this one's just kind of a nothing side area. Like I, I just stumbled across this area, you know. And we found the first of those three bones, so that quest turns out to be much easier than I... Oh, this is... Oh, this is how you get here, because I, I did see these, I didn't notice uh, what they were. Right, okay, okay. This, what does this give us access to? Another chest, it's a boy chest, cool. What's this got inside of it? Oh, it's a Nilfheim cipher. Oh, so this will allow us to unlock the Nilfheim. Oh, right, right, right. Of course. Yeah. Hmm. 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 Still don't know what that is. So, um, with all that in mind. Trusting a spirit to keep its word is foolish, boy. But if there's you. Okay, even, where were the other, the other two are over here, so we're going to head over there and try and get these other two, uh, yeah, try and get those other two, um, Don't you want to see Mom again? of course I do. Oh, she is gone, Atreus. You must accept this. I do, but to see her again, just one more time. Why do you believe him? You do not know him or who he was. All of this is sinister. He wants to see someone he loved again. I... I understand how that feels. I don't think there's anything sinister about it. Hope is blinding your instincts, boy. Ah! So, I'm following the uh, quest markers, which are leading me to this area, so we're fairly close. So both of these are kind of over here, actually. Mm -hmm. That story you started? We were near the end of Skadi's tale, as the Queen of the Hunt discovered that Odin had tricked her into slaying her own father. But I can just tell you the story later. Yeah, that'd be good actually. We've been here. Hang on, 160 meters. No, 16 meters this way. Oh. Yeah, it must be in here then. It's in this area. Okay, that's probably it there. Yep, that was Gulvig's bones again. What did you say to her? To Gulby? Your mother. What have you left unsaid? I... I guess... I just want to know if she's okay. She is dead, boy. I know that, I... That was a really yeah. sinister line raid. Neither do you. Oh, hey, look at this. Look at this thing we can get. These are everywhere now. Like, the first one we found was in, like, Alfheim, and they're like, oh, will we ever see another one? Plus two defense, nice, I'll take it. Come here. Can you finish that story you started? We were near the end of Skadi's tale, 
as the Queen of the Hunt discovered that Odin had tricked her into slaying her own father. Aye, there aren't many happy endings for the giants, I'm afraid. Uh, where was I going? <coughs> Text messages. 29, 28. Yeah, I think this might be near where we need to be for this new boat dock. Okay, so we haven't been here before. Forgotten caverns. Yeah, we have been here, haven't we? Okay. It's funny being able to get up here if you can't. Uh... <coughs> oh, I get it. You ride back down here. No, we haven't been here because look, there's an unopened chest over here. Is that? No, that's not a chest, that's a box. Bothar. Free me. Are, are you okay? No, son. It's another spirit. We haven't been here. The woods are underwater. The men are drowned, and yet their bodies continue to walk the beaches. Hellwalkers. They plague these lands. I was their captain. They died. I will find a way to free them from their tortured state. In this, I am determined. So that's a new one. All three of my ships across the lake. I know not what I did to anger Thor, for his judgment was swift and brutal. I'm worried now that we might have missed some content no we we were pretty thorough with the lake when it was at the the other height gotcha and it was that all three of them it was Hey, look at that over there that we should get. This, I think, is the... No, this isn't it. This is a treasure map. Nice. Good work. Oh, okay. Cool. Um, Is it up here, maybe? that oh geez so many buckets around here what the hell ah oh, missed so many buckets gods uh, is here I think this might be what we're looking for skull that's all Gulvig's bones yeah we might as well return them to the spirit. Yep, we might as well. He will keep his word. I know she's not coming back, okay? I know. I just oh, hey, it's this up here, upstairs area. Sorry. That we've been to? Oh, yeah, because look, that's... Oh, this is... Here. Under its head. So we've somehow been here. Yeah, because look, all this is here. Yeah, okay, so we, we did that. That's, yeah, because that's uh, one of the braziers that we've done. Yeah, so we did this one, we got that Nornia chest. Yeah, I remember this. Yeah, yep, that was a while ago. Yes, die. Yes, did too. Nice. Nice. Oh, hang on, there's another one. Now, now you can die. Is 
that's that uninterruptible uh, thing that this thing does. Which seems really cool, actually. Yep, okay. So they certainly weren't here before. So that's interesting, like, areas you've been through sometimes generate new enemies, so that's kind of cool. Is that a new, new beast tree? Yeah, Fierce Wolver, that's what these things are. Right, right, okay, cool. Uh, and we can just get back down. <laughs> that bird got crushed. <laughs> Atreus just tally fracked that bird. <laughs> oh, that's so bad. How do I get to that seed that we saw around the other side there? That was there, and it was just in... Is it around here? I think it's around here. Yeah, yeah there it is there. Whoa, so what's this area? Is this the way we went to... No, because I would have seen this. Earth, you are full of stories. When will you tell one that entertains? Luck! Yeah, I got that. So you want a cork up, do you? Very well, my brothers. Okay, let's see what's over here. Thing is, apparently we're just exploring the lake today and not actually doing story content now. Still. Let's see what's here, because I don't think I've been here before. I feel like I've been to part of this before, but not all of it. But I'm not about to go back and watch my old streams to figure out where I've been. Oh, look at this, this is behind. Is that an openable door? That is an openable door. Uh, before we open it though, let's have a look, because there's a punch chest here. Back that punch chest. Hey, um, in... How's my video quality holding up? Because I made some tweaks to it, I just want to make sure that it's, uh, it's looking better. Hey, it's a murder portal. Let's murder, let's see what's going to murder us this time. Oh jeez! Oh, we are doing no damage to these guys. Oh, jeez. Oh, come on, let me, let me know. Oh, no. Damn it. No, I'm not gonna revive. I'm not gonna revive. These guys are later. These guys are clearly for later. So I'm not gonna worry about reviving there. We should just be back probably before we open that portal, shouldn't we? Or maybe a little bit earlier, maybe at the beach. Yeah, no, we're just back here. Cool. Um, we'll open these doors and see what's in here, but that that that's uh, clearly a portal for later. Oh, hello. What is... Hang on a second. It's Dark Souls guy. Oh, and he's angry. He's got glowing stuff on him. Oh, jeez. That, that was an attack. Beating him with his own heart, it doesn't kill him. Oh, 
Whoa, why did I react to that? Nice. Okay, cool. Oh. That was a much more doable fight. And we got a Traveler's Grizzly def gr Grizzly thing. Hey boy, what's the name of a symbol of the light that binds all realms together. That's cool and all. Why would he use those strange runes though? Now you mention it. He wouldn't. Huh. That's another murder portal. Oh, that's the other murder portal. Yeah, okay, I can't remember. We've seen these runes before. But it's the kind I still can't Oh, he can't read these runes. Oh, right, right. So it's the other runes that we've been seeing he can read, but these ones he can't. Interesting. Interesting. Okay, um, we need to head back to there to talk to, um, to talk to, yeah, uh, what's his name, Gulveig. Do that now, hopefully there's a boat down here right now to find my other boat. I really hope there is a boat down here, because this will have been, yeah, there is, cool. Will have been a huge waste of time otherwise. And there's a dead Dark Souls guy here. They're not really Dark Souls guy, I should probably stop calling them that. Right, oh jeez. Amir just took a bit of a blow to the head there. Where I'm heading back around into here, yep. Yeah. Where that Gulvink spirit was. We get it? Yeah we did. I thought I did get it. Apparently I didn't. So is Gulveig in here or is he... Yeah, I think he is... Go under. That story I started earlier. I was to tell you the story of Brunier the Brawler. The there was a huge battle, right? The shrine had him in the middle, fighting off Aesir. A pretty story, but... No. Brunier this is where he was. Born with neither head nor heart. So the giants had to complete him with stone. He was strong, to be sure. But also he had to pass it in the back. No what? Or tell us from the back. Prepare yourself! I love this one. It's one of the best animations that one. Where is it? Where'd he go? Nice. Okay. Um, health, because I actually spent a lot of health, and we'll talk to Hrung here. Uh, 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 what's his name? Kol... Kol... Kol Vig? Uh, if I can find the spot where I need to be to interact with him. There we go. We have collected the rest of your woman's corpse spirit. Show us this magic you have promised. Ah, oh, my sweet Gulvik. Whole again. Rise, dear Gulvik. Awaken, O oh powerful Gulvik! Uh-oh. Egni Uka Birtiast. She says she'll honor our request. Uh. And reunite us? She's gonna kill us. Okay. You're right. He doesn't seem particularly tough, though. She's actually just a revenant type, isn't she?
Yeah, that, that was handy, actually. Can't get the stun on her. Where is she? There we go. This is true as well, but do not take your disappointment out on me, boy. Take it as a lesson. Yes, sir. Surprisingly, uh... Surprisingly, um... Mellow of Kratos to say it that way, to put it that way. Okay, well we solved the lot. Let's go, uh, progress the plot a little bit, maybe. We'll see what happens. We'll head back to the main tower and, uh, see what happens. There's probably other stuff we can do around here. Um... But for now, we'll just go back and uh, go into the middle. Lemire, you're in the middle of a story. Before. Was I? Oh yes, the real story of Hunyor the Brawler, a giant with head and heart of stone. Odin met him wandering in Midgard one day, found him so amusing, so harmless, so gullible, that he invites him back to his palace in Asgard. There he gives Hunir his fill of mead, and goads him into all manner of ghosts and antics, all for the amusement of the court. Hey, what's that? I saw the Aesir laugh as Hunir leapt upon his shield and swore he'd kill us all and take our womenfolk back to Jotunheim. Then Thor shows up. And does he laugh? Oh no. Thor takes one look at the drunken stone buffoon. Brings down Mjolnir on his head so hard that he's got chunks of Hunir in his own skull to this day. Thor is so startled by the face full of rock, he doesn't notice Hunir's body topple right onto him with a sickening crunch. And again, the roars of laughter echo through the palace halls. That's an awful story, Mimir. Nothing like the one's mother told me. Let that be a lesson, my son. Truth is seldom so pretty as myth and legend. Right, okay, three bells. So that's bell one, bell two, and bell three. Oh, and that's a bad guy. Okay, jeez, that... that... Oh, didn't mean, quite mean to do that, but we'll, we'll take it, we'll take it. I'm actually very convinced that stun arrow, for fighting enemies, stun arrow is vastly better than my... Because being able to build stun is just crazy good, no matter what. Oh, wow. Oh, you're an ice guy, aren't you? You can't be, uh, axed. You can, however, be killed. Nice. Good work. Good work. Whoa, so what's this area? Okay, there's a lot going on here. Hang on a second, I can't hit that. That's behind that gate. Right, okay. Um... Oh, this is... Where that huge wheel was that opened... Yeah, remember, this is where... Um... Yeah, this is this place, uh, Vithagard, which is where that first dragon was. But yeah, there was a huge wheel and a couple other things here that we couldn't do because we didn't have shock arrows. But we can now do. Got some world serpent scales, nice. Okay, um, I need to close this gate, but by doing so I think I make it impossible for myself to get back around here. So, getting those Norn things might be the last thing we do here, rather than the first. Something over there too, but I'm not sure what. Uh, 
that's not accessible yet. It's nowhere. Oh, hang on. Boy. Oh, that might be for that wheel. Rock arrows. Okay, that's freed that up. Chest we can't get to yet there. Or right over the other side there, there's this. Huh. Then how on earth are you expected? Like, you cannot ring that bell. Do the gate. There's no way. There will be no possible way of doing this. Ah. Because you've got to raise the gate. Which covers that bell, unfortunately. So you cannot hit that bell with that gate raised. Yeah. So there's something else we need to uh, deal with here. Before we can do that. But we have just unlocked that wheel. Let's see what this wheel does. Uh, let's just eternally spin this. Yeah, it just eternally spins this, but to what end? So I'm assuming that you've got to rotate this wheel to create a path, maybe? But where from? I think maybe that thicker one there, that... Maybe. I don't know for sure. This is not easy to figure out. Can you jump onto that? No, you can't you can't get near it. Uh. No, no, that's not right. So you can't get near that. Um, there's nothing climbable here that I've missed it. Around here, no. no. Hmm. This is uh, interesting. This. And whatever's in under here, we don't know yet either. I'll wind the wheel this way. But I don't understand how you would get onto the wheel. Like, unless you can get out onto those rocks over there. Or sail a boat under here. Look. You do that, it opens a clear path to get a boat through there, but why would you ever do that? What benefit does that serve? So what are we here? What else is around here? Not a lot. Okay, well, I'm going to get in a boat, and I'm going to go around there and see uh, what possible benefit we gain from uh, setting the wheel up. Can you get a boat through there? Yeah, you totally can. Maria, is there a story for the giant with the flaming sword? Shoot the brave. You know what? I'll tell this one later. But why would you do this? Oh, 
Oh, I know why. Oh, of course. It's so you can have this lowered, go back around the other side, and then get all... Okay. Okay. Yep, of course. So now that we've done all that, we can actually go... Yeah, okay, okay. Right, right, right. And go back around to the other side, and now we've got access to all three of those bells. We can get, um, whatever it is that's behind that, uh, Norn door. Simples. Very, very simples. Oh. Hey, my camera is pointing slightly the wrong way. Let me just make an adjustment with my camera. There we go, I think. How do I look now? Hang on a second. Let me let me check this because I just noticed my camera was pointing too far up. Check what it looks like now. Now it's too far down. Hang on. Let me just make a small adjustment. How's that? Perfect. Cool. Okay. Sorry about that. Right now. This is so. One. Two. One. Two. Oh, I'm bad at this. One. Two. Three. I missed that. Ah. Oh. I keep missing that middle one. One. Two. Three. Two. One. Oh, I missed it. No, we got him. No, we didn't. Oh, jeez. This middle one. Two. Oh, come on. No, no. That stuffed it up. One, two, three. Crying out loud. Ah, come on. One, two, oh, I didn't hit it. Wait a minute. Hang on a second. Wait, even when I do hit it, it doesn't go down. Hang on, something fishy is going on here. Hang on a second, I have an idea. It might be a specific order we got to do this in. Two, um, There we go. I think what it is, is that middle one doesn't go off for very long. Like, a lot shorter than the other ones, maybe. This is lying on the ground. This better be an important... Oh, hang on, there's a lot here. Well, is this very important looking chest? It probably doesn't have a lot in it. No, that's a, uh... Glaive Storm. What does that do? Oh! I tried that out. That seems really solid. Let's punch chests. So, uh, ah, got it. Die, 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 die. Die. Silver and. More stuff. That's kinda it. Look of it. Yep, that seems to be all that's in here. Oh, well. Okay, now I have another destination to go to after this one. Which is actually just further around here because there is a little bit more here that we couldn't do when we came here the first time. We can now. Oh, I wonder if there's more through there, because of course that would have been the same level as this. 
I will find that out a bit later. Can you start that story again from before? Yeah. Wasn't it sewer trailer brave? Of course. We've spoken so much of frost giants. It's about time we instead met the most fiery giant of all. Look. Back when Emir first emerged from Ginungagok, it was sewer who followed next. He came from Muspelheim, the Fire Realm, bringing heat to the young cosmos, conjuring the sun from his primordial flame. But let's come back to that plaguey sword, shall we? Or I can just tell you the story later. So hey, remember when we were here before to open that gate and we couldn't get to this area because it was underwater? Uh, boy. What are you on? You're on that. I want you to be Oh, no, why? Yeah, there's more to this than it initially seems. Oh, hello. Yeah, let's try out our new runic attack, hey. Wow, that did a lot. That did a lot. That was solid. No, it does not. Oi. Um. Be able to open this, shouldn't we? Need to find the. No, I need. I might need to throw uh, some stuff at it. Well, that's unique. I don't think I've seen one of these this far away from the wall before. Oh, it was right down there. Oh well. Yeah, so this is up here, and we could see this wheel. And we could see that this was all lopped off by, uh... So we could see that wheel. We could see that it was all lopped off by, uh... stuff so he cannot shoot down there there's this chest up over here yes yeah, so i remember we came here we couldn't open this chest but also we were missing about half this area so is there a place around here where i can get that just opens those, so that's fine. What I want to know is if there's an area around here. So this is where the boat dock was, originally where we came. This this is that level. This is now lower than that. Ah, hello. Hello. Now lower than that level. Is this a chain we should kick down? It is a chain we should kick down. Okay, and that's freed up that wheel. Um, which can now do that, but I can also I also can jump across. The question now becomes, why do I want to blow up this wheel? Jump. So now we can hit, but why do we want to? What does that gain us by doing that? Ah. Uh. Oh, you know what it gains us? It gains us that chest. We're blowing up one of these nodes on the wheel at the right moment, which is about now. That frees up this chest. I think that's basically all that it does. So, what's in here that's so good? Deadly Grip of Fury, okay. And... 
pristine dust of the realm. That's not too bad. Now, there, boy. And that's freed that wheel up, and now we can do the same thing over there to that chest. Let's uh, get back up. And I think we need to go all the way up here, so climb again. And yeah, that's got that sorted. So we should be able to blow this chest open. Whoops. Okay, his timing is not great here. Ah! My timing is not great here. There we go, perfect. Now, that gives us access to this wheel. Which allows us to raise this chest. This chest has that on it. And that blows both of those up, nice. Okay, so we'll go back around here and get this other chest. There's one final piece of this puzzle, which is, uh, actually, it's probably just spin the wheel. That is an enchantment. Frost resistance enchantment. Okay, that's alright. Was there anything more in here? No, there wasn't. I wanted to make sure. Whoa, hello. Who brought you to the party? Actually, I just realised something. Shock works really well against these. You know what else might work really well here? Oh, no, I took the too, too much damage. Shock really messes these ones up. Everything just messes those guys up, though. So that was interesting. Health. I got health. Jeez, I must have been lower on health than I thought. Whoops. Uh, okay, okay. Um, so I think... Uh... Stop. Yeah. And that is indeed the secret to getting this chest. And I think this is everything here. Just some Spartal Home Steel. That was a lot of effort to go to for some soft Spartal Home Steel. Down a second. What about this chain though? Boy! I don't think so. Yeah, I'm not entirely convinced we can do it with the chain. Maybe from a different angle, but maybe that chain is... Maybe I'm just overthinking it and that chain's actually nothing. I'm down here anyway, just in case. Oh, hey, there's actually another another chest here. Okay, cool. Boy. It'd be tricky, this one. Oh, how on earth are you going to get this? Because you need a very good angle here. Ah, oh, okay. That's pretty forgiving, actually. Cool. What's in here, I wonder? Okay. 
World Seven Scale. Now that we're here, let's try and see if we can get the, um... No, no, because that would have blown that chain up right then. See, the chain is not a thing. Oh, complete. oh no, I was going to say I completely missed this punch chest, but I did not. This is where that enemy came out of before. Um, yeah. Oh, I can't jump across yet. Oops. Gotta wait for this broken section to come around. Ah. There we go. Did miss this punch. No, we didn't miss that punch chest. Okay. I'm wrong. I'm wrong about everything. Okay. Uh, do I want to go around into there just to see if there's anything different over here? Yeah, I would feel incomplete if I didn't. Oh, hey, actually, there's one thing we haven't checked. Nah, there's there's nothing boat-wise around there. From oh, hang on, is there? Hang on. Is it boat? Is that boatable? No, I, I need to turn my boat all the way around just to. Nah, there's an invisible barrier there. Yep. Okay. I'm gonna head in here see if there's anything different. I won't, I'm not convinced there will be, but we are now much lower into here than we were before. Never sleeping, ever honing his fiery blade. Brave, generous suit. Who knows he lives but to his Let's just have a quick look to see if there is anything in Vithagard. Yeah, this is new. Know what? I'll tell this one later. This is very new. How tough are these guys? Oh no, they're easy. Cool. Oh, hello. We got a lava ancient here. Don't have a huge amount of health either. That was not what I wanted to do then. Oh, I'm so close. Okay. A perfect parry these, eh? Oh! Oh, nice. That was good hit. Oh, damn. Oh, we'll use we'll use the stone this time. Oh, I thought I hit it. I feel like we can do this pretty easily. I'm just... I was trying to get a bit fancy, unfortunately, so... Yeah, I got a bit too fancy there. Oh, hey, I... Oh, I could have stunned it. Oh, no. I completely screwed that up. Now I can stun. Now I've got to stun. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go for the big hits. Okay. Oh no! Oh, it was so dead! Oh! 
Oh, now I've got to do the whole thing again. Oh, so dead. That hit would have. That hit probably killed it, and just killed me right at the same moment. Ah, oh, so close, so close. Ah, oh, that's infuriating because we were so close to beating it, and then just that last hit. Kill these guys first, definitely. Okay. Yeah, take this guy out for sure. Anything we can kill that isn't the lava giant right now is really handy. Didn't get the, didn't get the parry. You can parry it though. You discover that you can parry him. Didn't get it that time though. That was a parry. That just went back at it. No, not the parry. Maybe I should stop trying to get the parry. Maybe I should stop trying to get the parry and get that guy killed. He's done. Oh, I cannot get this parry. We did kill the other guy, though, so that's, uh... That part of our lives made easier. Oh, gotta hit that right. Uh. There we go. Perfect parry. Damn it. Did I get it? No. No. Oh, let me move forward a little bit. It doesn't even matter if you do get him, actually. It actually does not matter if you get them because it, when you return them, it doesn't do any damage to him anyway. Okay. Got it. Okay, let's see what we can do. Come on, how much? One more, one more, one more good hit. Are you joking? Ah, oh, one more good hit and I would have had him then. Oops. Come on. There we go, killed him. And we got the parry just for good measure. How good was that? Our enemies are strong. Uh, strong's a strong word, I don't think that's strong, they're just annoying. It's health that's lying around that we should have got earlier in the fight, but oh well. Oh well. Beat that guy, so that's fine. God, we were so close though. Oh wow, look at all this area.
That, I'm going to guess, takes you up to the upper area that you would walk through to get to the rest of this zone. Um, I mean, I'm going to go up there. I just wanted to see if there was anything else around here. I want to see where that actually leads. But I suspect that uh, when we get up here, it'll actually lead back to um, where we were. So where's that jump? Go up here, it will lead us to... Yeah, right here. Yep. Yep. And... Yeah, uh... It's Brock? Yeah, Brock. Hey, uh, where it is, someone put down that loudmouth Magni. Yep. You know anything about that, would you? No. Thing or a bad, thing? bad thing for you when his daddy finds out. But one less AC or farting around suits me just fine. In fact, next upgrade is on the house. Oh, that's nice. No. <laughs> As if Brock would ever be nice. Can't you and Sindri just patch things up? Whatever happened couldn't be all that bad. You're family. Now don't be lecturing me about family. I ain't the one what forgot what our name stood for. What we made... The weapons we made were legendary across nine realms for more years than I can count. You just don't throw that away on account of one bad... One bad what? The one bad nothing. Ain't you got somewhere to be? Hey, where's your beast of burden? What do you mean? I ate her. Crap bits of her out just a while ago. What is wrong with you? What? Her milk ran dry. She was your friend. Then she'll be happy I'm so well fed. Shit bricks, boy, you got a real sentimental streak, know that? Don't get too <laughs> sick of out there. I'm getting back to it. He's great. I love Brock. Okay, have we got anything we can do upgrades wise? Uh, we, we can upgrade an axe pommel. Not this axe pommel. We can upgrade Deadly Griff of Fury if we want. I don't know if I do. Um. I don't have anything else I can upgrade. Can not upgrade, uh... That requires two more Dust of Realms to get an upgrade, but I can upgrade Shadow Gauntlet of Ages. Which is what we've actually got equipped, that's right, yeah. Yeah, so we don't actually know what this does, do we? Let's upgrade it anyway. Because that makes it better. Makes it level 7. Now it has a second enchantment slot on it, so that's nice. Now I'm all out of hack silver because boy does that cost a lot to upgrade now. I've got Tears Lost Unity Belt. Oh, this relates to the uh, gauntlets I'm wearing at the moment. Um, but they're not as good as my... What's War Belt of the Traveler and why aren't I wearing it? Um, what? What belt do I have equipped right now? I don't know. Um, oh, we should get a Resurrection Stone, because... Oh, no, I know, I was going to say we used one, but apparently we didn't. Um, what about Heavy Runic Attacks? <coughs> no, we still can't get that. Um, I have anything here that I can sell? No, okay. So, hang on a second. Ah, what am I looking at? Armor. Um, hang on a second, I've got... Oh, right, right, right. So I'm wearing Tears Lost Unity Gauntlets. What about the waist, though? Oh, hang on, hang on. That was, that was something you could craft, wasn't that Tears uh, Unity thing? Um, this could be upgraded again, probably. Runic Worm Skin Portraits. Those look cool. Increase my runic damage, but not everything else. I've got dwarven runic portions, which I'm pretty okay with at the moment. Go back. Let's get you squared away. Let's have a better look. So chest armor, he can't make this yet because we're and it's not quite as good. It's also more about vitality than anything else, I think. This I need small. Okay, so all of these come from. Uh, yeah. Okay. Right. That's just not an upgrade. That's not an upgrade. That's not an upgrade. Shouldn't be an upgrade. 
It does have more strength, but uh, yeah, it's, it's a downgrade otherwise, yeah. Yeah, everything's a straight downgrade for my chest armor right now. Uh, I can upgrade this though. I haven't done. Hang on. I I'm wearing the runic worm skin pauldrons. Yeah. Chest armor. Because my current ones aren't upgradable. Yeah, okay, okay, okay. Yeah, I see how it is. Son? Oh, no, I don't have it. Right, okay. Okay. Okay, and then this is just back here where we've already been. Yep. Okay. So it was just that little area there. Nothing too significant. That's fine. Um, might go and progress the story a bit. Well. What are we doing? Where are we going? <laughs> Must be pretty shallow here if the, that's the bottom of the doors. Oh yes, Stuart the Brave who accepts his fate to perish in Ragnarok. To truly embrace your purpose and the patience and sacrifice it demands is to ensure your day will come. You think we'll be there when that day comes? I've seen enough of war between the gods, but you little brother, who can say? Okay, it looks like that story ended already. Hello. Oh, that's where we need to go. That's that's where we need to go for the story right now. Ooh, Tyr's vault is behind that magical wall. Yeah, I was just thinking. Yeah. Uh, nope. One. Two. Hang on, was it down there? Three. Nice, good work. Wow. I can't believe we're setting foot in Tears Vault. Another one of these. It's already been opened. The middle panel is missing. Wait, yeah. I thought Tyr was a god, not a giant. Ah, but he was loved by everyone, including the giants. Other than me, he was the only one they gifted with their special sight. Hey, I wonder if the giants left a triptych about me somewhere too. I will find out one day. Um, what's down this corridor? Oh, I bet I know what's here. Yeah, it's the door on the other side. Yeah. And that seal broke automatically. So we could have come around either side and broken that seal and come into here. So. Uh, is there anything? No, it's just runes and there's nothing else in here. So let's uh, interact with this. Actually, come along. Let me show you how to read this. Okay. You taught me so much. Let me teach you something. Andreas. Come on. You already speak it. Learning to read won't be that hard. I know how to read, boy. Just not this tongue. You're halfway there already, then. Okay, so the runes represent a lot of different things. Some gods, some animals. Wait. Some... Oh, am I going too fast? Sorry. Not I'll... that. You smell something. Yeah, I do. It smells like. Uh-oh. 
Hey, remember how we didn't kill this guy before? Oh boy. Oh boy. You don't know anything about my mother. Oh, it's true. But I'm going to get to know you really well. You're going to be my new brother. Right. Is he going to kidnap Atreus? Uh-oh. Uh-oh, here we go. Spartan Rage, let's go. You're gonna get punched, man. Mind you, that's all I've had to do so far. I can't I can't punch or attack. Oh well. Just beats him with his own hammer. Oh, can we just kill him now so he doesn't come back later? Ooh. Ooh, he's he's not well. What's the bit now we have to go to Freya? Yep. Yep. Yep, let's go. Uh yeah. Uh I cannot run. This is as fast as you can move right now. Well, Freya should know a few things, and I've got... Ooh, 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 ooh. Time of day change. Take the boat. Freya's isn't far. I know where Freya's is, mate. Also, the the light on my uh, controller changed, too, then. Yeah, we've got a time of day change and everything here. Is it that way? No, it's not. Yes, it is actually, yeah, yeah. Because it's around through here. Yep, here we go. That time of day, that lighting change, that, that's dramatic. Especially now that you've taken to killing his kin. This forest is a blind spot for him. This is our smartest move. And if anyone can heal him, it's her. What is happening to him? I've seen it in mortals that some conflict of the mind expresses itself as an ailment of the body. Never in a god, but a god believing himself mortal. I can only imagine. We're almost there. Atreus is a god and doesn't know it. I'm not sure why I've only just now realized this, but it's true. How are we going to get up there? There's a lot of, like, climbing and stuff to do here, unless this is just... No, it's not going to cut us, because, of course, this game has no camera cuts. So it's not like we're just going to walk here and suddenly be at Freya's. We're going to have to find our way up. Fortunately, there's a lift. But I seem to recall we had to climb a well. That's not a good noise. Somebody just called the serpent. Oh, did that change? Is does that mean the Lake of the Nine has another level? That's insane. If so. Oh, hey, we're in a cutscene again. This lift's going up higher than I remember it ever going. Oh no, here we are. 
And we can just walk to our front door, of course. The fever burns hotter. He is shaking. It's serious. We must hurry. Well, I would, but like, this is literally as fast as we can go. I'm assuming we can actually get in here this time. Like, normally you can't, but because this is important plot related stuff, yeah, we can. Over the door! We need your help! He's not there. Mother, do you hear me? It is urgent! I'm still a god, go away! The boy has fallen ill! Bring her! This is no ordinary illness. The boy's true nature, your true nature, fights within him. I did this to him. Will you help me? Of course. There is a rare ingredient found only in Helheim. The keeper that protects the bridge of the damned. I need its heart. Hmm. Hell. The realm of the dead. Do you know it? Well, this one. It is a land of unyielding void. Fires cannot burn there. No magic in all the nine realms can create a blaze. As for the dead, your frost axe will be useless. You'll need to find something else. Then I must return home. Oh, are you serious? Dig up a past I swore would stay buried. Oh. Before it doesn't matter. This boy is not your past. He is your son, and he needs his father. Are we gonna get God of War? This rune opens the bridge to Helheim. When you are there, do not, under any circumstances, cross the bridge of the damned. There is no road back. Understand? Boy. Himalay. You must hurry. Through my garden there's a path leading to my boat. Take it. Return home. Dig up your past. Do whatever you need to do. Just bring me back. Oh. Are we getting the blades of Athena? Like, are we about to go full Kratos? When last we spoke, I was... No. You were right to distrust the word of a god. No need to explain. Not to me, not for that. I will keep him safe. That's a mother's promise. So... <clears throat> Probably something that needs to be explained if you haven't played the previous God of War games. Um, Helheim of all places. You all right, brother? I will do what I must. Leave me be. Right. Um, As you wish. And that is, oh, and of course, it's all flowery and stuff because it's Freya. Um, whoa! Door is upset. I guess the boat knows which way to go. So, uh, yeah, so the bandages on his arms are actually the chains that he has, and normally there'd be swords chained to them. Uh, it's not super visible right now because, of course, I'm wearing these gauntlets that cover the bandages. Um, but normally you'd have big swords, and the swords were his weapons in the previous games. Where is he going to go home, though? Oh, hey, it's that deer. The magic horns. Oh man, I was gonna I was gonna call it a night there, but we we're gonna we're gonna do this now. This is big plot twists. This is good cutscene too. This is good character building. Notice it's keeping him close so that we don't see any transitions. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh hello. Hello, Greek goddess. Yep. Little pan around will be in grace. Yep. Get out of my head. Oh, 
She's just sitting there. Man, that was really freaky the way she just appeared. Where are we now? I have camera control here, but I, I, that's all. Oh, look at these visuals. Gods, I need to replay this game in HDR just to see how good all this stuff looks. This looks fantastic right now. So are we in Greece yet, or are we still in um, Midgard? Because we're clearly going to Greece slash Mount Olympus slash whatever. At least I'm assuming that's where we're going. It's going to be a very strange transition though. I don't know how it's going to go there. Has Athena gone? She has. This is a long, long boat ride. Whoa, what's that? There's stuff here. Where are we stopping? Just here from the look of it. Wait, is this not where we started the game? Yeah, this is where we, we carried the tree trunk. We're heading back to um, Kratos' house at the start of the game. We're we in hell now. So as she said, our axes will be useless here. Although not that useless. Useless against this guy though. Oh, I got cold. Ow! I cannot move! I couldn't avoid any of that! There's an infinite number of them. So that's what that does. And yeah, th this seems to be the only way to like attack these guys. Oh, jeez. Need to dodge roll more. I don't use the dodge in this game enough, actually. He's done. Get all our health back. As much of it as we can. Yeah, this is um, this is the start of the game again. Yeah, it is too. We're right back here. It's, uh, what does that mean, I wonder? Like, how does this transition into being Greece? Or does it? Do we just not go to Greece? Maybe, maybe the things he needs are actually just here. Oh, you know what? They're under the floor. Yeah, that's why he didn't want his son going down there. Ah, uh, okay, yeah, yeah. So we're not going to Greece. But we are getting the Blades of Athena. Very convinced of this. Oh yeah. Let's do it. Let's go full Kratos. Gotta do it, mate. Oh, he took the gauntlets off. I suppose it's important for this cutscene. Oh man, this is gonna look pretty... Yep. 
Yep. We got we we, we full god of war now. Oh boy. So does the band-aid did the bandages cover the chains or are they the chains? There's nowhere you can hide, Spartan. Put as much distance between you and the truth as you want. It changes nothing. Pretend to be everything you are not. Teacher, husband, father. But there is one unavoidable truth you will never escape. You cannot change. You will always be a monster. Oh, this is solid. But I am your monster no longer. Oh, this is good. Yep, just walk straight through it. Right, let's do it. Let's God of War. Oh, yes. Spartan rage it up. Oh no, it's still punches and stuff. Oh. Wow, this Spartan rage actually seems stronger. But then I did get upgrades to it as well, didn't I? Oh wow. Yeah. This is the god of war we all know and love. All we need now is the combo counter. You know what? This explains something. This explains why we've been able to upgrade the axe so quickly. Because of course now, we can upgrade these. I was thinking, because I'm not convinced we're more than halfway through the game. And I've been thinking um, that we haven't upgraded. Oh, that feels so good. Take the shortcut back to the realm travel temple, then on to Helheim, yeah? Right, well. Oh. Okay, let's get a good look at what we can do with these. It's quite the combo. Okay, so you got all your... So, R1 is all your horizontals. And R2 is all your verticals. Now, your R1, 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 R2. You can. Oh, yes. Oh, this is strong. Oh, I am so happy right now. This is God of War. This is how you play God of War. Let's head over to here. Pretty sure you weren't talking to me back there. Anything you'd like to get off your chest, brother? I can assure you I'm unsurpassed in keeping confidences. Yeah, I'm sure you are. You know where to find me. And for the record, I'd already guessed you were Greek. Athena, dead giveaway. Yeah, well, now you know, mate. And I'm super happy that we actually do get Blades of Athena. I did not know that was going to happen. Because the axe was great, felt good, really fun. But nobody played God of War because Kratos used an axe. No, I'm fully on board with this change. And it, and it just, and it makes so much sense too. Of course he has the Blades of Athena. Why wouldn't he have the Blades of Athena? Yeah, well. What are those? Oh. I've never seen the like. That's not a family heirloom. No. 
Nor will it ever be. Son, my brother and me created Mjolnir for the big idiot. I know from quality. And him? Him special. Hey, where's the little turd? He was full of new. No. What happened? Aesir? No. The fault is mine. And my responsibility to make it right. Well, we all gotta take responsibility sometime. Huh? Say, what can I do to help? I can do things. And when I should tag along? No. Your work here is enough. All right. So where are you off to in such a hurry? The realm of the dead. Helheim? Shit, this is serious. Don't. I'll be keeping my eye on you. Okay, so what can we do? Blades of Chaos. We need Chaos Flame. Okay, we're getting full Dark Souls on this lot. Okay, so that's what we can do there. We've also gained new enchantments. Symbol. Oh, we've got epic level symbols. So those are new. Um, Blades Pommel? Oh, they have grips. Smoldering. Oh, jeez. You know what? Suddenly, um, uh, Muspelheim makes more sense. And we've got a Berserker's Red. How is the Resurrection Stone activating now that we don't have thing O? Oh, Ooh, I wonder. Hmm. Hmm. Right. Um. Okay, I suppose the other thing, seeing as I haven't been spending XP lately, I should have. Yep. What can we get? Melee and Elemental Combat? Oh right, right, right. I didn't even didn't even check what you could do with um with aim mode on. But of course you can. Let's uh start by investing in melee. Um because we're gonna need a lot. We're gonna need a lot of this stuff, so let's grab that. Oh, and these aren't even upgraded yet. Ah uh, yeah, okay, so. So we already have that. This gives me packs in quick succession without staining damage to the pet. Oh! The Blades of Chaos do fire damage, because of course they do. Chaos Flame. Dark Souls. That's the pull, and that's the sweep, the other attack that we got. Right, this is strong. Hey, and with these equipped, I just realized we don't have runic attacks. These use their own runic attacks. They have their own pommels. So we're basically starting afresh with these. Like this is five strength, 70. if these are what you need see these these build your runic rather than your strength so that builds your strength that does nothing these build your runic oh right neat you know I've never upgraded a runic attack <laughs> I keep forgetting that it's even possible to do that <laughs> Oh dear. Let's uh let's do it, let's transition. Now that Freya's given you the travel room to Helheim, it should be unlocked on the table. Yeah, I, I kinda figured that, mate. Right, well. Jotunheim, Alfheim, Realm Te Helheim, Realm Temporarily Unavailable. Here we go. Yeah, 
here we go. That was a lot less uh, magically intense than the last time. Oh no, hang on a second. There we go. There we go. Here we go to Helheim. I kind of want to stop playing, but at the same time, I kind of want to play with these blades a bit. Because these blades are strong. And you can shield with them too, which is really cool. Yep, you do, you, you do that, mate. Let me take this moment to tell you that what you are about to do is absolutely insane. Not even Odin can survive this moment. So, I hope those blades work. Welcome to Helheim. Whoa, look at this map. This realm is maybe not. Let's just keep going. Is this the bridge Freya spoke of? No, we're still on the realm travel bridge. We're after the Bridge of the Damned. The dead use it to cross into their permanent home, the city of Helheim. The bridge keeper who minds admission, he's the one we want. Just follow this bridge. It should lead us straight to him. Still don't know. That's the second one of those we've came across. Never to see this place again. On the other side, was there another staircase around here? No, it's just that one there. Hello. You know, for something that's um. This is good. I am very strong, very happy with this. That's what that's what you need for that. Right. Right. Okay, so those chests that are blocked by that, this is what we needed. Uh, I think I'm in combat. feels so good. It's the best it's ever been. Am I still in combat? I can't open that chest at all. Like, it just, I can't seem to trigger the point where the interactivity happens on it, so I think I might still be in combat. Dark silver. Ah, yeah, these guys. I think these guys might have been keeping me in combat. Oh. Okay, that should have put me out of combat. It's this chest now. There we go. And there it is. There's our runic attack, Spartan Charge. Flip it, because we don't have anything else at the moment. Nice. So now all of a sudden, going strength. I suddenly want to respec into going runic. Still. Let's see what we got here. This seems like it's going to be the second big major sort of zone area that we've done, actually. Like, this is the second one, after we travel to Alfheim. This is the second major actual story mode zone. Like, I won't deny a lot's happened in the story since then, but... Oh, this is all wrong. Only the newly dead should be here. There's too many. The gate must be closed, and if the gate's closed, then it's true. Hell's full up. Without the Valkyrie to sort and cull them, hell is overwhelmed. We know what happens when there's no more room in hell. Is 
This is strong. This is fantastic. I never want to use anything but the Blades of Athena again, which probably means I need to start getting runic stuff. Because I haven't been using runic. Because it didn't seem necessary. Strength just seemed the best option. Well, there's a side area somewhere around here. Hang on. Yeah. Yes. Yep. Well, I guess this is the way we get into hell. Rock? Oh, I couldn't have made it to an enemy. Dead enemy. Oh, that's strong. That broke his guard. And we got a punch chest. Okay. See what's here. Ah, it's climbable. When we killed the Reavers near my home, they came here. How did they return so quickly? Time doesn't move the same between all realms, especially where the spirit world is concerned. Like the light of Alfheim. The opposite, in fact. The Lake of Souls feels faster than Alfheim time, but hell is much slower than Midgard. Sorry, I'm sure that's confusing. If we will be back to my son all the sooner, that is good. Ah, aren't you a quick study? Ah, uh, okay, yep, so it's time in that I can... Ah! Who brought you? on these things ASAP. Did we end up successfully? No, we didn't. To climb up here and burn the top part, I think. Oh no, I think we need to go around the other side and burn that. Uh, yeah. Yep, there we go. Not this will be much of a chest, but no. um, I think this actually is going to be a good place to leave it for now. As much as I really want to keep going now, because I'm really excited to see what happens in this area. Um, I really should get to bed as well, so I'm going to do that for the moment. But boy, do we have some stuff. Let me uh, save the game. Oh. Boy, do we have some stuff. Wow. I was not expecting this. But, uh, yeah, that was... Uh, whew, big plot revelations and stuff like that. And now we've got the Blades of Athena. We've got the real God of War starts here, eh? Um, so that's pretty cool. I'm going to make a small adjustment here too. Hopefully, mostly for tomorrow night's purposes, but we'll see how we go. 
um anyway yeah that'll be uh it for tonight so thank you all for watching and i will see you all tomorrow